Okay, so let's take a look at how you can create particle effect for sun. So we are going to create this in GDevelop. So first thing is that this sort of effect can be useful in 2D games as well as semi 2D or 3D games as well. Okay, so what we will do is we will create one empty project. And here you can see I have made my scene color dark black. Okay so that it would be visible you can use any background image if you want that suits this particular effect okay next thing add new object and then choose particle emitter then give it a name let's say sun then choose point then we have to make a bigger size so go with 60 then keep the color colors same for now then remove this delete when out of particle instead use additive rendering keep the opacity values same okay then maximum number of particles let's start with 300 and keep the flow of particles in tank infinite with minus one value then comes flow of particles set this to higher value 100 and then minimum and maximum emitter force you can choose that set to zero zero if you want so we will experiment with that then spray cone angle that would be 360 because we want sun so entire round then comes radius i will try to experiment with value of 10 in gravity keep it zero then minimum and maximum particle lifetime should be one one okay then particles start and end size we can start with one end with 100 okay so once that done we can apply save and then drop this on screen if you want you can use this to make it go downwards or upwards okay so i will experiment with that as well to show you how that goes okay so save this and run and here you see the sun effect that you can add so imagine you have some 2d background and at the top you want this particular effect which maps with that particular 2d background can again experiment with let's say reddish color and mix of two okay and not go with the default one that i have suggested you so you get the idea how to make use of particle emitter for particle effect of sun in gdevelop